The name of our route is Bruder Liebe and the thing why, why, why that's the name of the route is we, we were talking, we were hanging in the wall and resting on the belay and I just did it because of love for my brother and that's why the route is called like that. Just before I started the project we uh, found a new girlfriend and then I was climbing on the crux pitch. It was really a crux pitch. And I was looking down, I was hanging on two hooks and I was looking down. And I saw, I saw just him kind of uh, lying on the, on the, <laughs> on the belay. And so I, I, I didn't, I didn't uh, need a rope on that time, but I saw that he was kind of sleeping and his mind was far away, you know, uh, by... My, my mind was away, but I didn't sleep. Yeah, yeah, the mind was away, but uh, he didn't sleep. When, when I went the first time climbing, I went with, with my brother and if he wouldn't gun with me, maybe I would play soccer, you know. The new line has two main parts. It's the lower part up to the, up to the ledge and the part from the ledge up to the summit. The lower part is characterized uh, of uh, high difficulty and really beautiful rock. Uh, slightly overhanging some pillars. There are three uh, hard pitches. One are maybe in uh, grade nine, and one is uh, the crux pitch is pitch number six. It's quite hard. It's uh, somewhere in the grade of ten. Uh, the opposite, the upper part is uh, quite opposite. It's not that hard, but it's alpine and wild, so you will also find some some loose rock. But it's uh, really an adventure to climb also the upper part. But finally, I'm really happy with the route. So I found a way through the whole wall, that was the, the goal. I'm really happy also because uh, the project uh, was born really a uh, long time ago when I saw first time these uh, two pillars and yeah. I hope someone will repeat it in the next time and say something about the grading and about my work on the mountain. Climbing the free soul in, of Il Pesce and Marmalata is maybe a big turning point in his whole life. Io ero sotto. Non sapevo che tu facevi il pesce. Se no, prendevo il binocolo, no? Prendevo il binocolo, ma non guardavo. <laughs> Era impossibile. Era una cosa impossibile. Anche i forti arrampicatori. Tu là hai dato una scossa Come si dice, una, una scossa eh. all'alpinismo estremo. Eh? Incredibile. Domani eh, alla parete? Sì. E sabato alla elico. Perché domani sono al lavoro io. Eh. Ah. The opening route is a lot of effort and a lot of uh, you need a lot of, a lot of time. But finally, when you reach the top, and I can tell you like it was when I reached the top on, of this new line, uh, all the effort is coming together to one point, to this single point on top, and you are feeling, you have the feeling of uh, completely happiness. And you're really happy about what you have done, not on that day, what you have done the whole two months before. And a project is, uh, to realize a project in alpinism is not just just the hours or the days on the wall, it's much more. It's uh, the thinking at home, going to the wall and uh, thinking about the project before you go to sleep at home, for example. To feel the whole adventure, what me and my brother uh, felt, you have to repeat the whole line. And uh, Hopefully, uh, in future, the, the people will repeat the whole line.